Let's discover how tectonic forces are slowly creating a massive body of water in Africa and reshaping the continent and potentially creating new opportunities for trade and tourism. A vast body of water stretches across the African continent, teeming with marine life and connecting trade routes. This may seem like a dream, but it's actually a reality in the making. A new ocean is forming in Africa, a process that's been happening for millions of years. It all starts with plate tectonics. The African plate is slowly moving away from the Somali plate, and a rift is forming as it does. This rift is creating a new ocean basin, which will eventually fill with water from the Indian Ocean. The process is slow but steady, with the ocean floor spreading apart at about 2.5 centimeters per year. This new ocean has the potential to change the continent in many ways. It could create new opportunities for trade and tourism and provide new habitats for marine life. It could also change the climate of the region and have an impact on the movement of species. As exciting as this prospect may be, it also poses significant risks that must be carefully considered. One primary concern is the potential impact on local communities and ecosystems. The formation of a new ocean leads to widespread displacement and destruction of homes and livelihoods. Additionally, the sudden influx of salt water could devastate freshwater sources and the plants and animals that depend on them. Another risk is the potential for increased storm activity and coastal erosion. With more coastline, there would be more opportunities for severe weather to make landfall and cause damage. Additionally, the constant pounding of waves against the new coastlines could lead to erosion and loss of land. There is the potential for the new ocean to become a source of conflict as countries and companies compete to control valuable resources, such as oil and minerals that may lie beneath the ocean floor. The formation of a new ocean in Africa would significantly impact the borderlines between countries on the continent and those surrounding it. As the ocean carves out pristine coastlines, it could change the boundaries between nations, leading to disputes and even conflict. The new ocean could divide a country into two separate landmasses, leading to questions about which country has sovereignty over which territory. Additionally, the ocean could create new islands that could be claimed by multiple countries, leading to disputes over control and resources. It would also change the way countries interact with each other, as the ocean creates new shipping lanes and trade routes. Countries may compete to control them, leading to conflicts and tension. The formation of a new ocean could also impact how nations interact with each other in terms of security. A new sea could create new opportunities for smuggling and illegal activity, and new challenges for countries trying to protect their borders. Forming a new ocean in Africa would introduce new trade routes and open up new opportunities for commerce and trade. With pristine coastlines, ports, and shipping lanes, countries on the continent would be better connected to the rest of the world, making it easier to export goods and import resources. With new ports on the coast of the new ocean, countries like Kenya and Tanzania could ship their agricultural products to other countries more effectively. Countries like South Africa could also use the new ocean as a gateway to Asia and Europe, opening up new markets for their goods and resources. The formation of a new ocean could also bring new tourism opportunities, with unique beaches, islands, and other coastal attractions. Tourists from around the world would be drawn to Africa, providing a new source of revenue for the countries involved, whereas the formation of a new ocean could also lead to new forms of transportation and infrastructure, such as a new sea route for cargo ships, ferries, and cruise ships would be established. Can you picture the endless possibilities that come with it? Not only will it bring new life to the continent, but it would also open up a plethora of job opportunities. For starters, the fishing industry will experience a boom as the ocean will be teeming with new and diverse marine life. This will not only create jobs for fishermen, but also for fish processors, marketers, and sellers. Tourism will also significantly boost as people flock to the new ocean to see its unique features and wildlife. This will create jobs for tour guides, hotel and resort staff, and other tourism-related jobs. The new ocean will also provide opportunities for scientific research and exploration. Marine biologists, oceanographers, and other scientists will be needed to study and understand the ocean's ecosystem. The formation of a new ocean will also bring about the need for infrastructure, such as ports, marinas, and coastal protection. This will create jobs for engineers, construction workers, and other skilled trades. Remember that Africa is home to many of the world's poorest countries, and this new ocean could significantly boost the continent's economic development. It's always exciting to think about the possibilities and opportunities that come with new discoveries and advancements in our understanding of the planet. Well, with that, we'll catch you guys in the next episode. Until then, delve into the countless possibilities of Mother Nature if this is true.